Uh, dear uh, Dr. Harshavadhan, I put yes, uh, all the wishes and uh, congratulations from all the SPEED faculties and the entire SPEED team to you for scoring you, at most rank in NEET 2020, MCS Speciality of Choice Urology, rank number 20. Fantastic. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you very much, sir. And uh, before beginning, uh, I have to tell one thing, sir. Yes. And uh, this is the most uh, memorable moment of my life, sir, because I never imagined that I'll speak to you in one day. Someday I'll, be, I'll get a chance to speak to you, sir. So thank you very much, sir. Thank you very much. <laughs> and it's my pleasure too. It's my pleasure to talk to you. And, uh, and something which is uh, really great and wonderful and you are in a very happy mood of uh, time and uh, appearing. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> so, you see, it's like a midas stage now. Whatever you wish, na, for everybody. <laughs> <come through. laughs> yes, sir. Sure. Yes, yes. So now uh, I want to understand from you about uh, your aspects of uh, medicine. From where you studied your medicine, yes. then where did you do your post graduation? Then what made you to choose MCH uh, urology as your specialty of your choice? What are the motivating yes. factors? What are the things behind this? Do this. Yes, sir. Sure, sir. So I am from uh, Karnataka, sir. So I did my UG from uh, Mandya Institute of Medical Sciences. It's a government college in Karnataka. And I did my PG from Enopoya Medical College, Mangalore. Okay. And uh, during my PG days, uh, my urology exposure was very little. Uh, I could say it's very less than even, not even 5% what we study in our uh, PG days. And okay. also I want to thank my guide, uh, Dr. Arish Chandra. So because of him, I got so much interest in uh, surgery. Uh, so I learned the subject, all basics uh, regarding the subject. So my general surgery basic aspects were uh, was a little bit strong because of my guide. So I want to dedicate that to my guide. And Excellent. then after that, uh, uh, urology, when I once I finished my MS, I just analyzed all the super specialities. So I liked, uh, uh, I usually uh, during my PG days, I was liking all these endoscopes and uh, minimal invasive techniques, all this laparoscope and all. During my PG days also, I was going to uh, laparoscopic, uh, these training things and all that turtle thing where we just uh, suture, not putting in the laparoscopes and all. Uh, and that uh, thing was available in the urology department. And uh, when I was uh, looking at the urologists, the way they operate uh, laparoscopically, and uh, there was a robot in our institute and they used to operate prostate and all. And uh, there was uh, 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 the Dr. Altaf was there in the urology department and Dr. Mujib Rahman was there, who was the HOD of the department. And when I see them operate and when, when I hear from my seniors how they operate, I thought that urology is a field where you have open procedure, you have endoscopies, you have laparoscopies, you have robotics, and you can treat medically also. So <laughs> I thought it's a subject where you can find everything. You can do open, you can do laparoscopy. So, but uh, the thing was, I didn't know anything about the subject. So uh, uh, soon after I decided, I decided that I will do, uh, uh, if I am doing MCH, I'll do it in urology. The first thing I did was I subscribed to Speed. I went Why? to Bang. I don't know, sir. Because since my, after my UG also, all my friends, they were subscribed to Speed. I took online coaching that time. I couldn't join uh, a Speed Institute in Bangalore. But I took uh, online uh, coaching that time. Just I bought a few materials from the Speed. But during my PG days, I couldn't attend Speed classes. Then after my PG, I went to Bangalore. Uh, then I went to Speed Institute there. Uh, I didn't know anything about the online classes because I couldn't come to Chennai to attend uh, uh, classes there because I had joined as a SR in uh, Mangalore itself. Uh, so I, I paid for the online classes. Then I just started uh, listening to the classes. Then I felt like uh, it's very deep subject. You just, if, you, if you're listening to the class, you want to know what subject is. So then I started uh, studying Campbell. Then I bought Campbell also. I subscribed to the class in a Bangalore and in Bangalore itself I bought Campbell. Then I just started the books. One thing my advice is we should not be scared to open the Campbell. Because when I speak to my seniors uh, about how to prepare for urology, uh, they were telling that uh, it's very difficult to finish the Campbell. You might not finish it. Better go with review. Yes, a review is good. We have to finish review. Review is compulsory. But I feel that if you, have, if you want some hold in the subject, if you want to listen to the classes, you want to understand the basic things, and if you want to tackle the questions which might confuse you, you should have strong backup of Campbell, at least twice or thrice. And one reading I gave completely, line by line. I, I even didn't leave a full stop or comma. Whether, whether it will go to the head or it won't go. And uh, 
I, I used to listen to the basic classes uh, from the speed, like uh, uroradiology and a uh, few things about anatomy and infections, inflammation. A uh, few things I was uh, listening on and off uh, during when I was in the college, uh, when cases will get over early and uh, when just after the rounds, I was working as SR. So I used to listen to the classes, I was taking the notes and few important aspects I was listening like uh, pharmacology. So pharmacology classes were there, were uh, few important like antibiotics and few important things which we use in the urology most commonly. Those basic things I was making notes. Then I, I finished my campaign in January or February. So once, once I finished, then I got some idea. Then I got the strategy, how can I move further? So after finishing once. So after February, a uh, line by line I studied. Uh, and few important, few chapters I couldn't uh, remember, uh, like uh, surgeries, like urethral reconstruction, all those things are somewhat higher level, uh, what we have studied in uh, MS surgery. Then general surgery, speed classes help me a lot, especially uh, 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 your classes, sir. You are all breast, thyroid, all I listen to your classes. And Akilan sir's uh, classes were there. Shock, blood okay. transfusion. Uh, Akilan sir. Anastasia. Dr. Aki, uh, Akilan sir. No, he, was, he took shock and uh, blood transfusion, electrolytes, all yes. basic uh, aspects. And Anastasia I studied about pre-op, post-op care, ERAS, and many important intraoperative complications, few anesthetic drugs, and all those things, especially some ventilation thing regarding ventilation and all, uh, anesthesia classes I, I listened. And at last I listened, uh, Rajan sir's class was there. All important MCQs related to surgery, some history, uh, some important milestones in surgery, some important clinical aspects. A senior professor was there, CS Rajan sir. Correct. So his two classes were there, I listened to that. And after, uh, due to COVID, when exams got postponed, five days I planned for uh, general surgery classes from speed. So full five days, it was a package. All thyroid, breast, <laughs> parathyroid, then GIT, your class, all GIT, I listened. So I got, uh, the thing is that, sir, we can study books. Uh, see, books will give us all theoretical knowledge. But when we listen to the classes by, you, by senior professors like you, uh, we'll get to know the basic clinical aspects. Means while teaching, you will just, uh, you will tell some clinical aspect related to that. For example, CA rectum, uh, low, low anterior section, ultra low anterior section. What is the difference between that? So how much uh, growth should be there from the anal work? I still remember your classes. <laughs> you telling <laughs> about peritoneal reflection. So all those basic clinical aspects. And that was I was scared of because uh, these things we won't get in any books. We can just uh, look at the basics we can study. But the clinical related things, I think uh, teachers only should help us. <laughs> so thank you for that. Sir. So after that, I revised Campbell and uh, Campbell Review. Uh, so Campbell review, I revised uh, thrice and Campbell textbook also I revised thrice. So because of this postponement, uh, I got time to revise Campbell also. So I gave some grand tests, some four grand tests I took, sir, in August. And those tests, I was very bad. Some two grand tests, uh, I was very bad. I, I, I cried in one uh, grand test. So the thing was, uh, but that gave me some confidence that to correct my mistakes. So that I should not repeat those mistakes in uh, exam. Uh, so even in exam, I was so conscious that I should not repeat those mistakes. So finally, <laughs> my rank is 20, sir. And I should thank all teachers for that. Really great. Did you attend all the topic-wise tests in the app? Uh, sir, topic-wise was uh, I attended few general surgery tests, sir. Uh, like a uh, few okay. things which, uh, which I felt like difficult topics. Uh, because, sir, in, uh, suppose if you take uh, in general surgery, breast, thyroid, shock, these are the things where we will miss many things and easily the question can be twisted. We get uh, confused easily, sir. Or especially these basic sciences, uh, what we see. Uh, so in grand test, I gave uh, three grand tests, sir. So grand tests were, uh, uh, see, it is a collective test. But when you come to a test of specific uh, topic, uh, there we get confused very easily because uh, everything will be covered in that topic-wise test. So I gave some three, four tests, sir. And uh, frankly speaking, few was like, uh, I had lost confidence also. Oh, my preparation is not very good, that thing and all. But after listening to the classes and repeatedly revising, because I had made notes of uh, important classes, uh, especially blood transfusion, shock, and uh, perioperative care, and infections, infections of, and HIV and AIDS also one class I had listened, where important points uh, regarding the statistics and all, I had made notes. So it helped me a lot in the last uh, five to seven days of uh, preparation. So I didn't uh, study anything new. So all these things, it's a collective uh, 
multifactorial sir what we think is not important it will be important at some or the other time nothing is uh, wasteful so even the small thing what we learn or what we listen it will come to help at uh, some point during our exams sir <laughs> so so it is uh, really great that you could share all the micro minute aspects <laughs> <laughs> and in feb i uh, i left a job sir i worked for 7 months from february uh, i came back to home and uh, i just started preparing because i felt that after finishing the campbell once i thought i need some time to again revise it but i don't know because again you can't read line by line again so important things i have to revise so i just went on uh, revising the underlined points which i had underlined during my first reading and also the highlighted points are there in campbell textbook so then after that uh, images and all uh, initially we began with seeing images from textbook but i couldn't cover sir so classes helped me a lot regarding euro radiology part uh, even before the exam also i have seen and uh, even there was a question also the captopril test and all uh, the previous day i had seen the class and uh, i didn't even uh, read full question also i just <laughs> i knew that that will be the answer so regarding uh, some uh, the day, the day before the video that he was next day the question was yes sir the question was there <laughs> that will build huge confidence yes sir huh? no more confusions will be there and we know what the question is you know what will be the options really 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 nice now uh, now what are the institution that you have shortlisted to join uh, sir actually regarding i have few health issues also uh, because before starting my preparation i had some bell's palsy i had so i took steroids i developed pneumonia and all so now i don't want to go very far sir so i am searching in south india itself planning to take nijam or cmc vellore so the two two college i have selected as first and second sir so. very good very good and both are very good institutions definitely you will get it for your rank there is no yes, issue thank you sir it. and uh, and once again i need to uh, wish you uh, for thank all thank you very much sir at the end of thank the day you take a lot of efforts uh, see the efforts is very important than the results yes. and yes. Uh, you have uh, taken that efforts uh, that is very very important yes, uh, so first you go and get uh, uh, registered uh, in bangalore yes. and at the same time buy a book yes. this is very very important step and you just we do something and we don't follow it up and that may not yes. be and one more i have to thank the speed institute sir because uh, i subscribed on uh, uh, june uh, may 25th 2019 for the class it was one year package so i thought the exam will be in june uh, 2020 but due to covid 19 the exam got postponed but my package was uh, coming to an end then i called uh, speed institute faculty uh, it department i requested them please at least uh, till our exam get over uh, please uh, continue my package because i can't uh, pay for new package now and i listen to the classes so i want to revise the those classes itself i can't listen to some new lectures now lectures now so please uh, can you postpone so they postponed it for me um, they extended my package uh, till september i am very grateful for that and uh, thank you very much for that and, and i think still it is not stopped and it, yes sir still it is not i will be watching uh, i will be seeing sir because uh, what all uh, classes are there whether it is stopped whether it has stopped i have seen till uh, september 14th because september 15th was exam still september 14th i have seen and last class i have seen was euro radiology so i revised all the images which uh, they have taught and it helped me a lot sir so we will keep continuing our uh, wonderful relationship academically and uh, Thank then you, sir. and also whatever you want to contribute uh, tomorrow in the platform as a faculty you are most welcome to speak to teach Thank uh, you, sir. aspiring for mch euro Thank you sir thank you very much sir and um, my my special uh, my special uh, regards uh, to all the students uh, thank you sir of, of karnataka as well because uh, i mean we when i when i used to come non covid situations in bangalore and uh, in gushapur uh, auditorium and we i used to we used to have classes and there will be almost 1200 1300 students who are uh, who are there from across as you said across <laughs> karnataka across the state and uh, there were all uh, wonderful times i don't know whether those days will come back or not after the covid post covid situations but uh, what i could uh, tell you is uh, really wonderful and um, thank you sir <laughs> and god bless you and we thank you very much sir give you all that 
uh, that you wanted in life and he is giving you still it will give you more whatever you wanted and your hard work has uh, repaid you and definitely is an example that those who want to start uh, yes, will definitely follow why your advice and i'll convey yes, all the and all your um, feedback uh, to the entire team okay. and uh, one more thing i have to tell sir means like uh, uh, one thing is after my ms my rank was 1900 sir uh, first my first meet just after my ms uh, because i didn't know anything about urology uh, then i thought that i should learn urology i should know what the subject is uh, i should know um, that's why i started uh, campbell i didn't listen to anyone um i just i, I uh, that uh, uh, everyone are scared of opening a campbell textbook but we should just start it it will uh, lead us in a good path always we should trust in books we should trust in teachers and that's what i tell self self confidence is very much important uh, during the preparation and everyone will help once we are in the correct path everything god will place us in a place where uh, that everything will come to us uh, good teachers good uh, study materials good sources one but we should be in that track and we should be very consistent in uh, studying so that everything god will give us we should not go in search of anything if you are doing going doing good everything will come to us and uh, speaking to you you also is a dream come true sir because when i go to bangalore and during uh, since my pg days also i was seeing the institutes where tra- top rankers photos will be there i was thinking how oh, these people will study how they will achieve this it's really great but today i am in that list and i am speaking to you because i was watching all interviews uh, from last year how they have prepared uh, so even i was thinking i should be in that place where uh, how they will study even we should do something like that but today even that uh, dream has come true sir and i am very much happy to speak to you sir thank you very much sir and uh, and it's because that you have invited me for this forum today <laughs> <It's>, <laughs> that when uh, it is just the force of attraction and gravity and it's it, the point that you made is very clear that 1000 1900 rank 20 yes. okay in in an one year the migration is, is quite possible with all the yes. points that you said yes, all sir. the points that you said the so people who listen to this interview and the video uh, should definitely uh, appreciate that 1900 may not remove 1900 1700 <laughs> it can come up to that uh, 20 and it is possible it has been proven right yes sir yes yes so, sir <laughs> sure sir and uh, and i once again i wish uh, thank you sir you will, will have absolutely phenomenal health no issues and uh, it's sir. all temporary and you be bold and uh, be strong and definitely yes, you will be back with full vigor uh, to do what you want okay thank you very much sir thank you very thank much you. sir thank you very much thanks for thank being you, uh, with us thanks for thank being you, with sir. us Yeah, thank, thank you, you very much. Sir. Thank All you, right. sir. Bye. Thank sir. You.